Green is a color as well. Every day you come at dawn, you come bearing a watering can, perhaps clippers, and every day I pray, wishing they were for me, praying to be plucked as those around me, with jealousy through my stems, maybe one day it will be me, but for now I shall continue to watch the creatures around me pick the roses over me. Perhaps my spiky leaves are not enough, as you prefer thorns. Perhaps my sharp aroma is not enough, as the dogs prefer sweet. Perhaps my fresh taste is not enough, as the bees prefer nectar. Perhaps my hue is not enough, as the world prefers vividness. Perhaps there is no place for a mint plant in a garden full of roses. The days will go on, the seasons will change. Yet I am still the same old green mint plant, hoping for a change in me. A few thorns, maybe, a simple flower bud, a hint of yellow hue. Praying for change seemed like an eon. Even the old sycamore tree gained colors by fall. Yet I am still the same old green mint plant. Eventually, the day came you walked up to my soil, clippers in hand, and you snipped off the two leaves closest to the burning sun, which happened to shine a little brighter that day. My leaves may have only been a garnish, uneaten and unacknowledged, lying on the rim of a cocktail. Yet that day, my existence was given a definition. Perhaps being a shove of green in a garden of roses wasn't so bad after all.